Welcome again to the USSC Lazarus, Kayla. Welcome again to the USSC Lazarus, Kayla. My head. What is all this? Where am I? Hello? Who's talking? Easy, Caleb. I am Hybris. Do you remember me? You met me in that inspection. Mm. Uh, where am I? What was I doing in there? Despite my condition, I have a hard time talking through walls. Take the time you need and do the medical test to make sure everything went well. Uh, I'm okay. It's just this puncturing pain in my cranium. That's why you must do the test. You can't imagine how often times the cortical chip needs readjusting after cryo sleep. Protocols are important. Seems like there are no psychos among us. Take the time you need to wash up. I'll wait outside. What's this? I think somebody's mistaken his locker. Caleb? Are you okay? Uh, yeah. I'll be right out. Hybris. Fuck! I'll never tire of this. Welcome to the USSC Lazarus. I am Hybris. It seems like you got out of the box okay. Uh, about that, what was I doing in there? Lazarus? I shouldn't be here, I- Questions. Questions. Don't worry. There will be time for questions. Talking about questions, y you wouldn't know whose device this is, right? Your curiosity will be the end of you, Caleb. I said there will be time for questions. I... I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to offend. It's okay. It seems like you have an incoming communication, Caleb. You can read it on the hall terminal. Strange. You shouldn't be able to receive communications here.
I'm afraid we aren't done with your evaluation yet. We can start wherever you like. You know the procedure. Insert the card, enter your password and we will be done before you realize it. I don't have the card. Here we follow a strict protocol I fear, Caleb. We are very concerned about leaks. You know. So please, go find your card. It is important to follow the rules. If you have followed them I suppose you will find the card in your locker. Hybris? Uh, I'm afraid I don't remember my password. Hypersleep must have affected me more than I thought. You're good for nothing. If I were you, I'd dig deep. I have a better idea. In the end, this gadget is going to be of use. What are you doing? I hope you don't wreck anything. It seems like you live your life intensely. You do everything for them, and this is how they repay you! The old carrot and stick. No one warns you that you get the stick while they eat the fucking carrot. What does this mean, Hybris? Can you explain what the fuck is going on? I'd appreciate it if you didn't direct your anger at me. I have no feelings as such, but I can simulate them. Sorry, Hybris. I just don't understand. I've done a lot for Gen Ethics. All those trips. The time I took away from my family. The loss always hurts. But it's not the end of the world. It won't be until five trillion years. Although... I think you have 3200 weeks of. You're not helping much. Well, in fact, I am. The ship doesn't generate oxygen by itself. Is there something I can do for you? I doubt it. I don't think finding a new job falls within your capacities. 
I need it, you know. Unfortunately, we still live in a world where bills do not pay themselves. I am sure you will find something. I am afraid you must pick up your stuff and leave the ship. I'd do so before we cast off. The space can be unpleasant. No. I haven't finished telling you, Hybris. I, I thought you were gonna help. The protocol. Take the things in your locker and get off the ship through the elevator. Thank you for staying in Lazarus. We'll try to make this quick. Have you worked for Gen Ethics? What the fuck is this all about? I wake up in a place I don't know, and now this? Were you in charge of inspecting the new cryogenic chambers of the USSC Lazarus? Yes, it was assigned to me. We begin to understand each other. Are you related to DY? Who? I, I don't know them. <laughs> It was going so well, Kayla. Think hard. I know somewhere deep in that obsolete storage you humans possess. You know what I need. Have you ever dealt with DY? Maybe they contacted me a couple of times, but I swear I didn't say anything. No one is saying you did so, Kayla. But maybe you have something to tell us. They tricked me. You know, I I'm just another victim. Easy, Kayla. You are doing very well. You're about to make a step forward for the first time in your life. Was the report you sent about the Yeoman cryogenic chambers true? We are aware that you looked into their technology and their amniotic fluid. Well, it seems like you have some guts after all. <coughs> Kayla? Kayla? Such shame. You look so brave in your actions and now I can see you can't even handle a little pressure. What do you want from me? I didn't do anything. I, I swear I'm just another victim. Now please leave the ship. You know. Protocol. Are you still here?
What's all this? Where am I? All of this makes no sense. Hybris? Is this you? Help, please? Wops. What are you doing there? I thought you were gone. It's a shame you are better at talking than disappearing. What's going on? What else do you want from me? You devil's machine. What did that tree mean? What was all that landscape? The tree? This is a spaceship, Caleb. We cannot misuse oxygen with trees. I think the fainting has taken its toll. I'm pretty sure of what I saw. Don't take me for a fool. And you still haven't realized that all of this is not my fault. It is only your fault. Let's forget everything. If you pull the lever all problems will be gone. Open the hatch. You know, protocol. It's important to follow the rules, right? Caleb. Welcome again to the USSC Lazarus, Caleb. 